Hey, what is up guys? It's Predator and today I'm doing a tutorial on how to beat Hammerman Get Over This Level 2. I saw this game being played on Reddit and thought it looked like a lot of fun, so I figured I'd give it a shot and man is it difficult. Um, I tried looking up a video on YouTube on how to beat it, but mostly ran into videos on people mouth breathing into their mics awkwardly or loud obnoxious music. So I'm going to try and walk you through this level and hopefully you'll be ready for level 3 when it comes out on the next update. So let's get into it. A lot of this is going to be pretty simple since you beat the first tutorial on the first level. Um, coming up on this ledge right here, you don't want to be right up underneath it. You kind of want to be a little distance away and you want to fling yourself up and catch it. That way you can go ahead and fling yourself up to the next level. Um, so you kind of want to back yourself off a little bit and kind of get this little ledge at the end and fling it up and set yourself down right up underneath the next ledge. Then you're going to hook up right here. You're going to throw yourself up pretty hard and rotate your hammer back around just to catch it. And then you're going to set yourself onto the next ledge very gently. Um, the trick to this part right here is you don't want to be on top of the ledge. You kind of want to be sitting right here on this little, uh, I guess, cliff end right here. And um, you want to hook yourself and do the exact same thing. You want to hook yourself right there on the, the middle portion, top portion, wherever. And you're going to fling yourself really hard, wrap your hammer back around and try to hook onto the tire. As you can see, I failed right there, so I went in and gave it another shot, and I went in and got it right there. Um, so we're going to just go ahead and set ourselves on to the next ledge here. You want to kind of set yourself up against this and gently put your hammer to the cliff edge and the little vending machine there and just kind of hold yourself there to where you're a little ways away so that way it gives you enough room to fling yourself up and catch the next ledge. From here, you're going to do the same thing, but you want to kind of bring the rotation inward so you avoid that cliff ledge and you're just going to catch yourself on the next one. Next one's pretty simple, same exact procedure. Now when you get to the top here, the sign that says that that way you want to avoid it. You don't want to go that way because all it's going to do is it's going to drop you down you're going to do all that what we just did all over again. So you want to come this way next to the stop sign. You want to get up underneath the stop sign and kind of wrap your hammer onto the top wedging it into the, the corner of the stop sign and the cliff. Because if you put it anywhere else, it's just going to throw you straight up and then... But So you want to catch yourself on this next ledge and kind of balance yourself. I'll go ahead and do that again for you. Um, you just want to wedge it right there into the corner and fling yourself up. And then you're going to balance yourself here, do a half rotation, and then catch it again. From here, you're going to bring yourself up and gently bring yourself inside and set yourself on this ledge. Once you're here, you're going to be fine. This next one is really tough. Uh, you basically just got to flick yourself from left to right, back to the left doing half rotation. So you're going to hook yourself on this ledge, bring the half rotation up, catch the next ledge, half rotation back to the other way, and then bring yourself down and set yourself down gently. Now, this is probably the hardest part of the entire level. Um, this is where a lot of people get frustrated and quit. The trick to this is that you want to set yourself on this little tiny hump right here, just dead center on top of this little hump. Um, whenever you do this, you want to do a pretty hard flick. Now, what you're wanting to do is catch your hammer just like this on that ledge. If you can do that, you're in the clear. You're going to be able to make the rest of it. Um, here in a second, I'm about to fail, but if you fall from this angle, you want to point your, your hammer back to the other side like this, and you want to make sure you're going to catch that ledge just so you don't fall all the way back down to the beginning. So I'll go ahead and skip forward to the next portion. Now we are back up to the top. We are going to go ahead and set ourselves back on this little hump here. We're going to fling ourselves really hard and catch yourself. From here, you're going to fling yourself up and do a full rotation just to catch the next ledge. You're going to do it again to get the third ledge. And the finish sign is actually a ledge itself. You're going to have to fling yourself up and catch that ledge, bringing yourself right over to the end. Guys, I hope this video has been very helpful for you. Please leave it a like. I would appreciate it. Take care and have a happy New Year's.